All right, everyone, I'm going to attempt to show uh, the measurements here for the products I'm going to be using. Uh, so I'm applying two gallons per minute uh, through my sprayer. Uh, I'm going to be using a 100-gallon tank. Um, so I'll be covering just over an acre. And this is going to come out to about uh, 10 ounces of dry material of prodiamine that I'll be putting in. Uh, so I keep the scale on my truck right there. And I'm going to fill it right there. I don't know if you can see that, that is 10 ounces. Um, what I like to do then is to put my dry material in an empty jug. Um, and so that way I can add a little bit of water to it, shake it up, make sure it's in solution before I add it to my tank. So I will attempt to do this on camera now. this here. Make sure that's out of the way. Well this is difficult to do on camera. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna add water to this first and then pour it in. Okay I got it cranked. Finally it's going, and she didn't want to go. I store her outside. I don't have indoor facilities, so now that that's cranked, what I will do is, here's my dry material. Add a little bit of liquid to it. Stir it around, mix it up. See, that's much better. Okay, and then, so per acre, I run a half pint of my alligator. Hang on. I gotta turn. Tank recycling is on. Let me open this jug here. All right, so I'm gonna run a half pint per acre of the alligator. Uh, so that's gonna come out to uh, eight ounces of the triclopyr. And this has a one ounce measuring uh, capture place there. You squeeze the bottle, it'll fill to one ounce. That's two ounces. And so while I have my tank and bypass, that means it's running, it's pulling and uh, agitating directly back into my tank. So I'm just going to pour that directly into my tank. I'm going to choke down on the motor, get my pre-emergent back, cap that. And so now, I'm going to add my three-way. I run this at four pints per acre, so that would be 64 ounces. This is for 50,000 square feet. I'm going to go 75. So that will be a full 64-ounce beaker. Directly 
in my tank. Plus another 12. Cap that. No accidents. All right. Then I've got my pre-emergent in the jug here. Of course, I have the cap secure. I will cap that. Shake it up really good. well so that's what we want so what I do now is I'll take my hose I will lock my gun in the on position and have that recycling back in the tank too so what that's going to do is that's going to mix my pre-emergent my weed control uh, through the agitation system and slowly filter the mixed material into my hose so that way when I start spraying on a yard I've got the right material coming out at the right rate. Uh, so that's how I mix the tank and that's how I mix the tank that I'm going to be spraying today. Uh, I'm mixing it on site and I will spray out all the material on site today before I go home uh, to make sure that any cleanup that takes place it takes place on the site which is uh, of course law here in Tennessee and is um, in most states I believe. Uh, so if you have any questions, comment, like, whatever, reach out to me. I'm around. Again, Matt Martin, Outdoor Designs. Thank you.